It's true. You can learn a bird from your car. This is Dan from Lead With Nature, and we're here to talk about a bird that really gets a rough, rough shot in the world. It doesn't get a lot of love, at least not in North America, or in the Bible, and in other places. In Japan, it's considered a sign of loyalty. This bird is all around me, singing. Its song is That, that raucous, constant, cheap, 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 kind of like that. It's a bird you've probably seen if you've ever eaten in an outdoor uh, dining establishment. If you've dropped some crumbs, it's right there to grab it right away. <clears throat> this is the house sparrow. Now, the house sparrow has two very distinct um, male versus female. It shows up really well. The male has this big black bib right here. Female, no black bib. But small, little, brown, on the ground. Sparrows. They live around humans almost exclusively here in North America. In their native ranges of North Africa up to Northern Europe, this bird was migratory, and still is to some degree, and it's actually known as a phylopatric species, meaning it migrates back to its birthplace every single year. But in North America, the, uh, they, don't, they don't migrate at all. Uh, they just hang around places where people live. Um, and these birds are amazingly adaptable and interesting and super social, but they just don't get a lot of love from the bird people for some reason. Probably because they're so common. It's easy to underappreciate the things that are right around us. So, there's a little philosophical thought from Learn a Bird. A group of house sparrows? You might guess this. They don't have the best names. Um, a blight. A subdivision. I've even heard of a pestilence. Um... These birds don't particularly uh, cause major trouble with people. Uh, they can, if you have an agricultural property, they can get into seed and stuff, and that could be a pain. This is probably the bird you've seen if you ever been to one of those big box hardware stores that's flying around. Oh, they're all around me. Oh, there we go. There's a female preening and calling right here. A little, and then there's a male singing over there. Oh, and there she goes. So, ladies and gentlemen, hope you appreciate the small, brown, diminutive, much um, degraded house sparrow. Because, hey, it's just like us. It's everywhere. It's interesting. It's, it's questionable at times, but it's a bird. So, learn a bird.